What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be doing a shooting test with this block of ballistics gel from Clear Ballistics. So, that's the sponsor of today's video, Clear Ballistics. I'm gonna put a link in the description if you wanna get you some ballistics gel at a great price and a great customer service. So, I'm going to be shooting it with a blowgun. Um, now, I'm gonna be using four different darts to shoot at the ballistics gel. Number one, is a razor dart. So as you can see, it's a pretty, pretty big uh, broadhead there with, uh, it's pretty sharp. And uh, hopefully that's gonna have some good penetration. Next we have these little rat darts. They're real tiny. Uh, I'm sure those are gonna penetrate, maybe not as well as the broadheads, of course. Next, uh, I don't think, place your bets in the comments. This is a bamboo dart. I'm not even sure what the point of them is because they're super light, they don't go very far, they don't have good penetration, and the tip will, like, it does nothing. It doles after you hit it with something. Um, so place your bets in the comments of what you think is going to happen. If you think it's just going to, like, bounce right off, or if you think it's going to penetrate, or if you think it's going to shatter the dart completely. Um, now this is the FBI block, so this is supposed to simulate flesh, just in case you don't know what ballistics gel is. Uh, you shoot it to see what something would do if it shot your flesh, if that makes any sense. So, last dart I'm gonna be using here is a, it's called a stun dart. As you can see, you probably don't wanna be on the receiving end of one of these things. Looks pretty painful if you're asking me. Now, uh, these would be good for self-defense if for some reason you live in a state that doesn't allow guns. <coughs> California. Um, I mean, if you have a gun, obviously use that for self-defense. Don't put your life in line with a blow dart. Um, but I am interested to see what this does because I, I want to know if it leaves a mark because it's got those little pointy things. I want to know if it leaves like a paintball looking mark or what it does if it penetrates, which I don't think it will. I think it's just going to bounce off and then go into the pool behind me and then I'll have to fish it out later. But we'll figure that out in time. So let's get to it. So I'm gonna get down so that uh, I can shoot it at a flat angle so that it gets the most penetration, hopefully. Now, if you watch Tim Wells, these are the broad heads I think he uses from what I've seen. And uh, he can kill a bear or an elk. So I'm assuming we're gonna get a pretty decent amount of penetration. I got slow-mo going up on the other side. Let's shoot. So as y'all can see here, it didn't get that much penetration, surprisingly. I thought it would get quite a bit more. That's interesting. So it only went a little bit in. I don't know how well y'all can see through here. Uh, y'all can kind of see it. But uh, it only went about like a half an inch in, if even that. So that's interesting. Next start I'm gonna shoot is the uh, rat dart. Now this could get a little bit more penetration just cause it's, you know, thinner. I'm not, e I'm not exactly sure guys. So let's just shoot and find out afterwards. Oh wow, that actually got a lot more penetration than the razor dart. So the shaft is also a little bit shorter than the razor dart but I did hit it up top. I don't think that's gonna make much of a difference, but as you can see, it went about an inch and a half in. And uh, so that did get a good bit more penetration than the razor dart did, which is a little bit of a surprise, but also not at the same time. It's just a little bit weird. Next dart, the uh, bamboo dart. These usually come with the blow guns as well as the rat darts. Uh, I don't have any faith in this. I'm pretty sure it's just gonna bounce off and probably fly into the pool. It's actually kind of hard to shoot in this position, to be honest. So, let's shoot. It actually penetrated. That's... Surprise! <laughs> now, as you can see, it didn't penetrate that much. 
but it definitely penetrated about a third of an inch, maybe half. But that's more than I thought it would do. Now y'all are gonna see on the slow-mo, whenever I hit the gel, it, it, the end of the dart did a little bit of like a, a twing. Y'all are gonna see that on the slow-mo though, so that was kind of funny to watch. But now I'm gonna pull these three out and shoot it with the stun dart. Alrighty guys, final dart, the stun dart. I'm super excited about this one, so I'm not gonna say nothing, I'm just gonna shoot it. Hopefully something cool happens. Hopefully it's not lame. And hopefully it doesn't bounce back and hit me in the forehead, because I can't imagine that feeling very good. Three, two, one, firing. Oh, it did come back and hit me, so that was kind of funny. Y'all are gonna see that in the replay. It nearly hit me in a very uh, not fun spot, so. Let's go check this out. I don't think it really did anything. All right, there is no way y'all are gonna be able to see this. It took me a minute to find it. The spot is right there. All you're gonna see is like a little circle mark. You can kind of see it right there. Just like a little circle. I had to shoot it another time after I turned the camera off because you, I couldn't find where it was. That did so much less than I thought it was going to do. Um, this sounds like a stupid idea. One day, if this video gets 10 likes, I'm going to let somebody shoot me with that. Just to see what it feels like. Because this test did not do anything. So I think that's like a, you know, not a fair way to see what a stun dart does. So, like I said, 10 likes, guys. And I'm gonna let somebody shoot me with it. So, there you go. Don't forget if you wanna get some clear ballistics gel, I'm gonna put a link in the comments. Thank you to Clear Ballistics for sending me this ballistics gel to shoot. And uh, stay tuned for more uh, ballistics gel shooting videos in the future. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.